recording from Big Hue Art. I have started the embellishment process. Uh, I had to do a pour right here. I know you can't see it, but I know where it was. There was a big crack. So we did a pour and you can see that uh, going below. Um, so today what I'm going to do is I'm gonna touch up these waves here, lots of texture in them. So we're gonna touch up these waves, add some embellishment, and let it all dry. Once it's dry, we're gonna put the epoxy on it and see how it goes. As you can see for the beach, I've used some gold. Um, the waves, I will be using uh, metallic white, and I'm firing some glitter in there because glitter is so much fun. Stay tuned.
Okay, so we're all done for today. We've gotten the waves in. We've gotten the glitter completed. And what's gonna happen, we're gonna let it all dry. Once it's completely dry, we'll brush off the excess glitter that is on the waves. Get rid of that. Clean it up a little bit. And then we're gonna wash it with some Dawn dish soap. Make sure there's no debris so that when we put our epoxy on, it is good to go. So stay tuned for part three. Okay, so this is the final product before I get the epoxy going. We got the waves and the texture in them. We got a little bit of glitter. Let me just move back so you can see the full effect here. So this is a 48 by 60 canvas. And all that is left to do is the signature at the bottom. Alright, so we have the ripple effect of the waves in this canvas. This is stage two of our 48 by 60 giant canvas beach theme. All that is left now is to do the uh, Dawn dish soap wash on top, let it dry, pad the back with cardboard so that there will be no bowing with the epoxy that we're going to put on and when the final product is all set this is going to look like a glass or a piece of glass so please stay tuned for stage three which should be uploaded next week and thank you very much for watching